Big story tonight at 5. Prosecutors criminally charged a Milwaukee father and son for damaging this controversial mural. Fox 6's Brett Lemoyne with what investigators say was caught on camera. We deny that we committed a crime. Prosecutors disagree. They charged Peter Mailer and his son Zachariah each with a felony count of criminal damage to property. Investigators say the men came to this mural at Holton and Locust in September and destroyed it. This mural really had the capacity to push people over the edge and endanger the Jewish community in Milwaukee. The mural depicted a star of David combined with a swastika. Milwaukee's Common Council even asked the owner to take it down. We believe that this was hate speech and that the city should have acted and they didn't. So what was left was vigilantism. They came prepared with an ax, a sledgehammer and some other hammers and they had at it. Owner Isan Atta says the mural was supposed to bring attention to the war in Gaza. He says it cost him more than $12,000. They did it in clear view of security cameras. Prosecutors say Zachariah Mailer even raised his arms and waved double middle fingers to the cameras. This is all part of that, right? He wanted to gyre up some, some controversy. You, you took the bait, though. I did take the bait. I did Do take the bait. That? No. Atta says what happened is a violation of his free speech. He says he plans to debut a new mural sometime next month. The mailers call the original mural a hate crime. We're going to fight the charges, and um, uh, Mr. Atta will have to explain his position. In Milwaukee, Brett Lemoyne, Fox 6 News. Brett, thank you. Atta declined to release his surveillance video to us today. The mailers say they plan to sue. If convicted, they could face a $10,000 fine and perhaps more than three years in prison.